Hondas Dornberger, Louis Dornberger, Robert Leinard, Fred Munkert, Jean Reed Munkert, Barbara Vaughn Reynolds, and Clifford Yinger. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Dr. Jim Sieber, Mayor, followed by the representatives of the class of 1951 and the members of the class of 2001.
Ladies and gentlemen and guests, please stand for the national anthem played on the saxophone by Eric Perala, an accounting major who has been a member of the concert choir, the Madrigals, and the SU band. Following the national anthem, the Reverend Bob Yo, Catholic Campus Minister of the United Campus Ministry, will offer the invocation.
Let us bow our heads in prayer. God in heaven, we have discovered the beauty of your creation. Fill us with a love and respect for life, nature, and education. May we come into your presence with joyful hearts as we prepare to celebrate this day our commencement ceremony. We give you thanks for the achievements of our students and for your parents, family, faculty, and friends who have brought them here to this day. Let us rejoice today in you and with you. Amen. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen and graduates, please be seated. Seventeen years ago, in a ceremony much like this, members of the class of 1984 anxiously awaited the start of their lives after the years of study at Shippensburg. Among the class was one graduate whose commitment to public service would take him from the halls of Shippensburg to the halls of Congress. Like his fellow graduates, Todd Platts was ready for the new personal and professional opportunities following graduation. Todd earned his law degree from Pepperdine University and worked for a law firm before his commitment to public service prompted his successful run for election to the Pennsylvania House of Representatives serving York County. During his seven-year tenure in the State House, his interest in helping people led him to being appointed to the Education, Transportation, Veterans Affairs, and Tourism Committees, among others. For this lifelong resident of York, another unique opportunity to serve presented itself when long-term 19th District Congressman Bill Goodling retired. Todd accepted the opportunity. Guided by Abraham Lincoln's principle that government should be of the people, by the people, for the people, Todd campaigned again on issues of importance to his district. Protection of Social Security and Medicaid care, the quality and safety of schools and health care. He won with more than 73% of the votes. In Congress, Todd served on the Education and Workforce Committee, the Government Reform Committee, and the Transportation and Infrastructure Committee. He was also elected by his peers to serve as the freshman class representative on the Republican House Leadership Policy Committee. In addition to his legislative duties, Todd continues to serve on various community service boards and agencies. Todd has become the university's first alumnus elected to Congress continuing the tradition of a long list of Shippensburg graduates who serve the public in an elected capacity. Ladies and gentlemen and graduates, please welcome Congressman Todd Black. Thank you, President Sedia. Good morning, trustees, faculty members, family members and friends, honored guests, and certainly soon to be Shippensburg University graduates. It's a great pleasure for me to be back on campus. It's certainly a true honor. 
for me to be given the privilege of participating in such a joyous occasion here at my alma mater. Shippensburg has and always will have a special place in my heart. But not just for me personally, but for my family. Besides my own graduation from Shippensburg in 1984, my brother Mark was in the class of 83. Both of my sisters attended Shippensburg for a portion of their studies, although they went on to graduate. They didn't see the, uh, see the light in time to stay here at Shippensburg, went on to graduate from other universities. But uh, we have a great family love of Shippensburg. Three of my cousins were also Shippensburg graduates. But Shippensburg also has a special place for me because as one who believes in public service and has worked hard to prepare for a career in public service, Shippensburg played a very important role in preparing me. Dr. Hugh Jones and other members of the government department, faculty I enjoyed, the administrators while I was here, have been instrumental in preparing me to be a good public servant, and I'm very grateful for that preparation and support. In the months since accepting the invitation to participate today, I contemplated what thoughts I should share, what message I should bring, and I settled on two themes. First, and very appropriately, is a message of congratulations on a job well done. Each of our graduates here today should take great pride in what they've accomplished. You've persevered, you've made sacrifices, both in time and finances, to advance yourself. And you've shown by your dedication here at Shippensburg that you understand the importance of preparing yourself for the challenges of your life ahead. And I commend you for doing so. Your work here at Shippensburg will pay great dividends in the years to come. I also want to congratulate our many family members and friends of our graduates who are here today. Your support and encouragement and love along the path to this day commencement has been instrumental in the success of your family members and friends, and I commend you for that support. And finally, to our faculty members, to all members of the Shippensburg University family here that have played a role in this day and allowing these outstanding citizens to go forward and reach this graduation program, I commend you. You've made a difference in the lives of countless individuals here today. My second theme I want to share with you is one of service to our nation. Given my time in the State House and my current service in Congress, you may assume my message of service is about governing and about participating as a citizen and voting, running for office yourself, about the importance of our citizens in America being involved in the American governing process. And while I fully encourage and hope that you will actively participate as citizens, today I want to focus on a form of service to our nation of a different kind. Today I want to emphasize the importance of and the need for each and every one of us here today to work diligently in making a difference in the daily lives of our nation's children. Paraphrasing a, a quote from Ronald Reagan, he, he said many years ago that if we want to do something for our nation's future, we need to do something for our nation's children, for they are our future. Many of our graduates here today will do just this in their professional lives as teachers, as social workers, as medical professionals, law enforcement officials. And I commend each and every one of you for your devotion in your careers that you are going to go forth with to help the children of our nation. And I certainly wish you much success in that endeavor. As a nation, however, we cannot rely just on the professionals in our communities. We need to look to each other. Whether it's in the role as a parent, as a mom and dad, as a grandparent, as an aunt or uncle, as a big brother or sister to our family members, or to non-family members through the Big Brothers and Big Sisters programs, perhaps as a scout leader, or a little league baseball or soccer team coach, we need adults to be actively involved in our children's lives. Our children need adult leaders who want to be loving and devoted mentors, role models, especially at this time in our nation's history. Over the last 40 years, the percentage of children growing up in single-parent families has 
skyrocketed. Whereas we are today with one third of our children living in a single family, single parent household. Percentage, percentage of two parent households where both parents are working is ever increasing. And the percentage of families who are not given the opportunity because of the multiple society in which we live, who are no longer able to live in a community in which their extended family, where grandparents and aunts and uncles and cousins live, to give that additional family support, that's less of a norm today. Our children need adults in their lives to lead by example, to exemplify what a strong work ethic is, to instill good moral values, to show and help develop excellent leadership skills, to demonstrate what it means to be a good citizen, to be a patriotic American. And certainly in a time of less and less interest in personal responsibility, I believe we need those adult leaders to be instilling personal responsibility in our young citizens. I look to my own life to how I've been blessed over my 39 years by so many adults whose love and support have given me the foundation for the opportunities I've enjoyed and the successes that I've achieved. First and foremost are my parents, Baz and Dutch Plass, and they are unable to be here with us today, but they are truly heroes in my mind. In fact, uh, my wife Leslie, who's in the stands with our two-year-old daughter, Kelsey, we have a four-year-old son, TJ, who'll soon be five. I tell my parents as a parent of two that they truly are no longer just heroes, they're saints because how they raised five of us and stayed sane, and especially knowing the five, my siblings, I'm not quite sure. But they are heroic in that they raise five children and in our home, day in and day out, were such wonderful role models. But they're also heroic because they did not just stay within the, our home. They taught by examples in the community. The one I like to share that I best appreciate today but did not as a 12 year old was when I was playing baseball and I played in two leagues when I was 12. I played in an afternoon league and I played in an evening league, the York Little League program. In the evening league, every child who came to practice and wanted to play got a chance to play. You were guaranteed that every child would play so many innings every week. In the afternoon league, there were no such rules, no such guarantee, and children would come every day and try hard and we would do our best, but children would regularly not get to play. Even though we would win every game, my parents thought that was wrong and they went to bat for the children of that league and they changed the rules where every child would get to play. What was impressive about this effort by my parents was when they changed the rules, I sat the bench because I was a starter. They weren't fighting for their own son, not playing enough. They were fighting for the other sons who were not getting to play. By their example, they showed that we need to look out for each other, not just our own family, but our community. And by their example, they instilled compassion for others in me. But I've not been blessed just by my parents. There's certainly been countless other adults throughout my life. My kindergarten teacher, Nancy Willoughby. My seventh grade school guidance counselor who helped a very, uh, I'll say, uh, quiet 12-year-old make a very difficult transition from a neighborhood elementary school to a large junior high. To my grandparents, my grandfather, Jesse Rittenhouse, who held a very special place in my heart till his passing in 1981 and to this day often guides me in my conduct. I am a person, the person I am today, because of the countless positive interactions I had with outstanding adult role models and mentors over the past 39 years. I would tell you the greatest honor I've enjoyed as a member of Congress was not taking the oath of office on the floor of the House on January 3rd who's not sitting on the inaugural platform as we inaugurated our new president, George W. Bush, who's not sitting in the state dining room at the president's table, enjoying lunch and discussing various issues. My greatest honor as a member of Congress came in the form of words from the lips of a four-year-old boy by the name of T.J. Plax, my son. Earlier this year, my family and a family friend joined me at a Republican conference retreat in Williamsburg, Virginia. The president joined us for a portion of that retreat. 
and was very gracious in the time he spent with our, the members and our family, including my children. Later in the day, after Leslie and, and our friend Lisa Flanagan was with us, and TJ and Kelsey had met the president and had a chance to interact with him, we're back in the hotel room, and, and Lisa said to, to Leslie, what a great honor it was to meet the President of the United States, George W. Bush, the most important man in the country. I wasn't there, but my wife Leslie shared with me that very defiantly and very quickly, TJ jumped up and said, George Bush is not the most important man in the country. My daddy is. I will tell you, I don't know if I can be honored in a greater sense than by those words. That in four years, I've made a difference in that young man's life and we're going to do my utmost to continue to do so. That's what we need to do as citizens. Today, we want to celebrate in each of our graduates. Today, tomorrow, for the next week, the next several weeks, take time. Enjoy this accomplishment and be proud of it. You certainly have earned the opportunity to do so. But after the celebration is over, Maybe it's a few weeks from now or a month from now when we return to, to Earth and the theater back in solid ground. I call on each of our graduating students, as well as each of the all adults here today, to reaffirm a commitment to making a difference in the lives of our nation's children. Today is a commencement ceremony. The end of your time here at Sittenberg, the beginning of a new life, a new chapter in your life. And one part of that chapter is you're making a transition, especially for those graduates who have come to Shippensburg right from high school, and transition from where you're the child receiving the blessings of countless other adults to where you're now the adult who needs to bless the children. That's an important assignment and one I hope which you, in which you will work hard and do your utmost. In my congressional office in York, I have a poster framed Actually, that my wife Leslie and my children gave me uh, two years ago on Kelsey's uh, first Father's Day with us as their daughter. And it reads as follows. A hundred years from now, it will not matter what my bank account was, the sort of house I lived in, or the kind of car I drove. But the world may be different because I was important in the life of a child. So I extend my heartiest congratulations and extend my best wishes for much success and happiness in the years to come for each of our graduates. But I call on each of you to go forth into the world with a mission to make a difference in the life of a child. To do so, to help to maintain our nation's greatness as a nation, and certainly you will bless that child or those children with whom you interact. Thank you, and God bless each one of you. Congressman. At this time, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to acknowledge the presence of some very important people who are not formally participating in this morning's program. Shippensburg University is proud of its long-standing relationship with the Juvenile Judges Commission and the training of juvenile probation officers, some of whom received their master's degree today. Today is my pleasure to introduce the new chair of the Juvenile Court Judges Commission, the Honorable Carol K. McGinley. Judge McGinley is from Lehigh County. Also joining us today and sitting in the stands is the Honorable Isaac Garb of Bucks County, the Commission's past chair who has participated in this program many times on behalf of the Commission. We thank him for his support and we thank the Commission and our new chair of the Commission for her involvement in Chippensburg University. We're also privileged this morning to have with us several representatives from the Council of Trustees. They are Allison Ford, who is among you as a graduate and our student trustee, Glenn Grau, Alan Holman, Steve Lures, Laurie Noggle, and William Piper. Would they all please stand to be recognized? And thank them for their service to Shippensburg University. <laughs> Representing the General Alumni Association this morning is its president, Bob Nelson. And again, I would like to acknowledge the members of the class of 1951 who participated 
in leading our graduates in this morning. Bob and the class of 51, please stand. Also this morning, ladies and gentlemen and graduates, I want to present to you a very special and important group of people. These are individuals who have dedicated their lives to this institution and to you as students and soon to be graduates. Please join me in applauding and recognizing the service of our faculty and administrative colleagues here at the university. I now ask them to stand. They are without doubt the best in the world. You can't do better than that. Also, I'd like to acknowledge a member of the faculty who's retiring this morning. Uh, it is Dr. Robert C. Stahl's last commencement. He's a professor of geography and earth science, and I'd like him to stand to be recognized. Well, thank you. For your <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's my pleasure this morning to introduce you to the president of the senior class, Lisa Pruker. Please welcome Lisa, who will present the class gift and bring greetings on behalf of the class of 2001. Hello. Well, we've made it. As I look out, I see many of my friends who I've been privileged to know and represent as senior class president. You're all amazing. When it came time to choose our class gift, we thought of several tangible gifts, but quickly realized that a bench will eventually break, and a flag in time will fade. Even trees may be removed due to our rapidly expanding campus. But there is one thing that will never change, the dedication and leadership of students enrolled in this university. Every class has outstanding students who work diligently to build up the university community. And I'm looking at many of them right now. Imagine our university without clubs and organizations. No craft, no senate, no Christian fellowship, no slate, no yearbook. I mean, I could go on and on. This picture would be a reality without the dedication of student leaders. So, as the class of 2001, we want to honor these students by establishing the class of 2001 Annual Scholarship Fund. Each year, a rising senior who is actively involved in building the university community through participation in clubs and organizations will receive the scholarship. Once it is endowed, our uh, once it is endowed, our class, uh, once it is endowed, <laughs> our class already has raised half of the cash required to begin the fund. And once the pledges reach the university and interest is earned, we figure that our scholarship will begin being awarded in three years. Our class is the first senior class ever in the history of Shippensburg University to establish a scholarship fund as the class gift and actually one, if not the only, to give a gift as undergrad that will continually affect others, becoming greater as the years progress. This would have been impossible without the senior class officers, the senior challenge volunteers, and you seniors, who have already donated over $2,500 to this cause. It is with great pride and honor that we established the Class of 2001 Annual Scholarship Fund as our class gift. Thank you, and best wishes in your future endeavors. That is indeed a great gift and a wonderful tradition to begin here at the university. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my pleasure to introduce Mr. Emmanuel a. Kinyele, who will bring greetings on behalf of the Graduate Student Association. Manuel. Good morning. 
members of the administration, faculty, parents, family, and students. It is a great pleasure to have stand before you today in celebration of this great moment. I'm excited to be graduating and to be moving on. Going to college is like going on a long journey to a foreign land. In preparing for the trip, we may have consulted the internet, the travel agent, or the travel channel, or talked to friends or family or colleagues who may have taken the trip before. The frequent traveler, that is, family, friends, or colleagues, represents mentors and teachers who give us insight in what's ahead of us. The travel agents represent our professors who are experts in their field. They bestow upon us knowledge and wisdom. As we prepare, we pack items such as maps, money, clothes, and toiletries. We try not to forget any item we will need on our trip. Our family and friends help us to pack our bags. They also like they also like cheerleaders who cheer us on our journey to this foreign land. We get support from them and they tell us that we're doing a terrific job. And their encouragement gives us confidence to go on the trip. We are finally on our way to this foreign land, probably taking a train or a plane. We're at the end of a trip today and we're about to take another trip. You see the trip that we took to get to Shippensburg University and beyond is one trip, one destination in a lifelong series of places we need to go and see. During our trip to SU, we have learned a new culture, a new way of life, a new language, and we have changed in ways we never imagined we would. We learn how to navigate our lives in this society. We also learn about the various social issues that are before our country. And along the way, we have experienced life-changing situations that we can consider as memoirs or lessons that we will never forget for the rest of our lives. For me, I have developed lasting relationships, grown significantly, touched someone's life, I am grateful for all the blessings that have been placed in my path. I have learned life lessons from my dearest roommate, developed professional networks among peers, and I have been positively influenced by friends and mentors. These are people who have helped me survive this trip. They have invested time, energy, money, and love in me. These are memoirs and lessons that I will take with me as I resume my course in life. When I have to do this all over again, I will collect my memoirs and lessons and I will march on. I hope that you too will get ready for the next trip, even if you buy a new set of luggage. Remember to make use of your SU memoirs and lessons. God bless you all. Ladies and gentlemen and graduates, Dr. James Coulson, Dean of Graduate Studies, will present the candidates for master's degrees. Dr. Coulson? Will the candidates for the master's degrees please rise? I have the honor to present for graduation and for the degrees Master of Arts, Master of Education, Master of Public Administration, and Master of Science. Those candidates who have completed the requirements for these degrees and who have been recommended by the faculty to receive these degrees. By the virtue of the authority vested in me by the Governor of the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania, the State Board of Education, the Board of Governors, and the Council of Trustees, as President of Shippensburg University and upon recommendation of the faculty, I confer upon each of you who has successfully completed a graduate curriculum the degree of Master of Arts, Master of Education, Master of Public Administration, or Master of Science with all the rights and privileges pertaining thereto. Congratulations.
Dr. Raymond Janet, an associate professor of English, will read the names of the graduates. Will the degree recipients please be seated and follow the instructions of the marshals. Emmanuel Akinyele, <laughs> Cynthia Sue Ash, Leslie J. Bird, Cynthia Ann Fowler, Stephanie Marie Grant, Thomas Henry Briggs, the sixth, John David Bryan. Daniel Joseph Bukin, Troy Allen Conrad, Sherry Lynn Coburn, John Randolph Daly Jr., Laura Christine Davis, Robin Christine D. Timothy Edwin Ayer, Wendy J. Pratt, Emily Lauren Gates, Jennifer Joe Greenholt, Adrian Sue Hamer Dehor, Michelle Renee Harris, Jennifer Lynn Heitzman. Jeannie Louise Lashley. Tanvir Memo. Tamara Joe Musumichi. Rhonda L. Meyer. Albert Louis Perillo III. Charlene L. Peters. Michael Andrew Post. Gwen Ellen Rock. Teresa Lynn Scaletta. Jennifer Lynn Schroeder. Nora J. Sykes. Will Robert Ushler. Megan Elizabeth Works. Stephen Paul Bishop. Lawrence Matthew Gaston. Ralph Anthony Farella. Donald F. Corey. Tracy Lynn Kiefer. David Scott Kramer. Patrick Joseph Dimmerlin. Lisa Cheryl Grove. Rafat Yakub Haddad. Paul Michael David Heine. Robert Lee Hockersmith. Hathaway Ann Johns. Crystal Ann Kagerice. Erica Joy Caruda. Jennifer D. Kinzer. Jamie Lynn Coos. Elton Richard Mansky. Patricia A. Mateo. Dwayne Alfred Moore. Lara Jane Mummer. Carol Lynn Murphy. 
Mindy Davis Musser. Gilbert Anthony Nelson. Monique Elizabeth Powell. Charlotte R. Rodriguez. Michael Charles Rose. John Albert Scott III. Matthew S. Shomo. Amy Carol Stanton. <coughs> Dean Allen Thomas. Gina Renee Zeger. Ladies and gentlemen and graduates, Dr. Rick Ruth, Interim Provost and Vice President for Academic Affairs, will present the graduates with bachelor's degrees. President Senny, Provost Ruth. Will the candidates for the back of the way of degrees please rise? and for the degrees Bachelor of Arts, Bachelor of Science, Bachelor of Science in Education, Bachelor of Science in Business Administration, and Bachelor of Social Work, those students who have completed the requirements for these degrees and who have been recommended by the faculty to receive these degrees. By virtue of the authority vested in me by the Governor of the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania, the State Board of Education, the Board of Governors, and the Council of Trustees, as president of Shippensburg University and upon recommendation of the faculty, I confer upon each of you who has successfully completed a curriculum in the arts and sciences, business administration, or teacher education, the degree of Bachelor of Science in Education, Bachelor of Arts, Bachelor of Science, Bachelor of Science in Business Administration, and Bachelor of Social Work with all the rights and privileges pertaining thereto. At this time, you may change your tassels and congratulations to all of you. The diplomas be, will be presented by Deans Dr. Stephen Olowiak, Dr. Uh, Robert Bartos, Dr. Janet Gross, and Dr. Marion Schultz. The names will be read by faculty members Dr. Thomas Burney, Dr. Linda Hoover, Dr. Uh, David Godshock, and Dr. Raymond Janet. David P. Adams, Amberly Alexander, Thomas Joseph Archfield, Theodore Davis Arnold, Kristen Michelle Bates, Michelle Lynn Barrett, Jason Brian Bartos, Nathan Van Bass, David A. Beardsley, Valeria Beers, Monica Ann Beatty, Sukiana L. Beatty, Michael Joseph Burke, Kristen Marie Birkenbaugh, Nicole Renee Birkenbaugh, Jesse Neil Blanton, Jeffrey Allen Bohr, Matthew Bolt, Jeremy Allen Bowersock, Kimberly K. Bozich, Lauren Ann Braun, Christy Lee Green, Samara Dennis Brown, 
Michael R. Brown, graduating magna cum laude. Joseph Frank Cruz. Chad Edward Bumbaugh, graduating summa cum laude. Russell Charles Fern. Eric B. Carroll. Stephanie Lynn Carter. Anthony James Casey. Eric John Kowal. Laura Ann Schumer. David Peter Polpo. Maureen M. Connolly, graduating cum laude. Brian Joel Cook. Michelle Lee Coulson. Brett C. Darchin. Angela Marie Dasher, graduating cum laude. Roland Ross David. Adam Lawrence Decker. George Andrew Decker. Heather Ray Durr. Jacqueline Ann Deschamps. Catherine Pauline Deal, graduating cum laude. Julie Ruth Diffendurfer. Richard D. Girolamo. Angela Marie D. Mariano. Rachel Elizabeth DeMusio. Darren James Pinkfield. Michael Philip Dorse. Trinidad Esperance Jr. Richard L. Etter, Magna Cum Laude. Frank J. Farmer. Melissa Fielding, graduating Cum Laude. Brian Curtis Fink. Catherine Ann Ford. Griffin M. Frank. John D. Fred. Christina Elizabeth Frock. Jason Andrew Gatanopoulos. Tricia Renee Gottney. Luis Emiliano Gayos. Damian James Golden. Dustin Ryder Goodhart graduating from Laude. Diana Ray Goat. Julie Lynn Godshall. Janelle Heather Grant. Jay Erickson Grant. Stephanie Jill Hoberly. Andrea Renee Hackenberg. David Earl Hackett III graduating from Laude. Stacy Marie Hand. Kate Hannon. Lindsay Allison Harbart. Jody Ann Harris. Darren Lee Hartzell. Beth A. Hopp. Drew M. Henderson. Megan Beth Hirsch. Robert John Hershaw. Charmika Nicole Hill. Brian Christopher Hollander. Carrie Holsoffel graduating Magna Cum Laude. Scott Christopher Hunt. Melissa Marie Hudson graduating Summa Cum Laude. Christina K. Hines. Jason E. Jeffers. Stephen Keith Johansson. Daniel Douglas Johnson. Jeremy Warren Jones graduating Cum Laude. Amanda Jane Kaiser graduating Magna Cum Laude. Constantine Calandras. Robert J. Keeney. Andrew Scott Kepner. Lucy Kerbogi. Anne Elizabeth Kingsborough. Andrew L. Kinsinger. Daniel Joseph Peralt. Brent Edward Kirshner. Christopher D. Nose. Pamela Denise Koontz. David Michael Post. Eric Allen Costelet. Brad Phillips Project. Receiving, Brad is also receiving a Bachelor of Arts degree. Michael Joseph Kroll. Anthony Edward Lamarck. Jennifer Lynn Landis, graduating from Laude. 
David Kyle Lineweaver, graduating cum laude. Justin Matthew Leisure. Rebecca Ann Leiter. Patrick M. Lengel. Jennifer Ann Libelsberger. Jamie Elizabeth Lockman. Jamie Beth LaPiccolo. Christopher D. Magano. Keith Lane Mather. Craig Lee Mayer. Nathan Douglas McLeat. Tara K. McCormick. Gregory S. McGinley. James Robert McGuff. Holly Lee McGowan, graduating summa cum laude. Joseph Gabriel Mazzano. Victoria Alexius McKesson. Heather Marie Miller, graduating cum laude. Melinda Lee Milleron, graduating cum laude. Derek J. Missimer. Edward Robert Mallory. Danielle Jessica Muma. Christina Marie Murren. Todd Eric Myers. Michael Anthony Nepsley, cum laude. Holly Lori McCary. Jason Paul Osberg, Joseph T. Palm, George Francis Albert Pestino, Andres Fernando Palazzi Raquina, graduating cum laude, Celindia V. Peru, Jonathan Paul Phillips, Corrine Melissa Piccolo, Ashley Kathleen Kirk, graduating cum laude. Tammy Nicole Price. <laughs> Jeffrey William Putt. <laughs> Beth Patrick Rafferty. <laughs> Jason Patrick Reed. <laughs> Jason Clifford Regner. Nicole Rochelle Resser. Tracy D. Richard, graduating cum laude. Tika Renee Roberts. Brian Lee Rahasian. Raymond Lee Rosenberg. Sage Tedden, graduating cum laude. Brian Wesley Sakers. Christina Ann Santoro. Aaron Elizabeth Saul. Kelly Joy Savage. Anthony Vincent Scalise, Daniel Charles Schaefer, Maria Teresa Shusha, Margaret Ann Sikor, Angela J. Shoemaker, graduating Magna Cum Laude, Brenda J. Shoup, Catherine Ross Shoemaker, from graduating Cum Laude, Kimberly Ann Schultz, graduating from Laude. Harvey Brandon Schumann. Scott Eric Simon. Tim J. Stoughton. Adam Robert Smith. Andrew Clark Smith. Brian Cooper Smith. Nicholas Michael Smith. Philip N. Smith. Sarah Elizabeth Smith. Jamie Lynn Summers. Matthew Ray Sokol. Natalie Noel Stankunas. Stephen Andrew Spielman. Joshua Michael Steiner. Michael D. Stevens. Laura Ann Stirk. Andrew Marshall Stinson. Eric David Strandberg. Karen Ann Campanella. Jamie Lynn Taylor, graduating cum laude. Leah French Taylor. Tammy Beth Kendis. George Ivanov Toshev. 
Sherry Lynn Hover. Michael P. Tornatella. Todd Dustin Troutman. Jacob L. Trogulski, graduating Magna Cum Laude. Patricia Ann Flutter. Nicole Sherry Uglo. Clifton David Vince Skaya. Patrick R. Vilecki. April Wadel. Lindsay Ann Wakefield. Krista Marie Waldner. Stephanie Nicole Walsier, graduating summa cum laude. Tori Brian Wallace. Jeremy Israel Weibley, graduating summa cum laude. Thomas Alvin Weibel. Megan Ann Winger. Shane Andrew Wiggum. Jason Allen Wicker. Melissa Jean Wick. Darren Richard Wilson. James Anthony Wingard. Eric Marine Wright. Karen Allison Wurst. Jill Renee Warren. Frederick Z. W. Zentgraf, Jr. Matthew Lewis Zuby. Jamie Natalie D'Angelo. 
Sean Michael Davies. <laughs> Tiffany Lee Duar. <laughs> April Nicole Green. <laughs> Dusty Anna Lynn DeBrock. <laughs> Ryan Michael Donnelly. Graduating summa cum laude. Daniel S. Dornblazer. Justin Michael Dovey. Scott Wayne Durbin. Jennifer Marie Dutterer, graduating magna cum laude. Janelle Marie Ebersole. James Robert Eichelberger, cum laude. Jessica Marcia English, cum laude. Emily Ann Evans, summa cum laude. Donna Lee Fonestock, summa cum laude. Stephanie Ruth Ferris. Tangela Jo Fix. Allison Renee Ford, graduating summa cum laude. Michael Bossy Fosnot. Kristen Elise Froman. Kelly Marie Frump. Tammy Barber, cum laude. Jennifer Leah Gippy, magna cum laude. Jennifer Elaine Gill. Nicole Teresa Ann Glasser, Magna Cum Laude. James Block Celtic. Megan Marie Getter. Stacy Marie Golden, Magna Cum Laude. Jared Zachary Botts, Summa Cum Laude. Tara Lynn Goshorn, Cum Laude. Christina Ruth Green. Jenny Lynn Griswold, Magna Cum Laude. Janine Nicole Brzezinski, Magna Cum Laude. Jason Robert Cade, Cum Laude. Joseph Henry Halowitz II, Magna Cum Laude. Jamie Kathleen Hannell, Cum Laude. Emily Louise Harnish. Jennifer, Jennifer Lee Paragala. Amanda Lorraine Hayes. Andrea Lynn Hepp. Kristen Leah Helfrich, Cum Laude. Jamie K. Hill, Magna Cum Laude. Lakia Ann Hill. Colin Kurt Hirschman. Kira G. Hort. Michelle Lynn Hoffman. Monica Sarah Hoffman. Brad Isaac Hort. Vanessa Dawn Howe. James Taylor Howard III. Kelly Arnell Pearl. Kristen Lee Kane, cum laude. Patricia Ann Kelly. Amanda Renee Kelly, cum laude. Lynn Marie Kelly, cum laude. Ryan Patrick Canary. Melissa Leanne Poser. David Leo Kovalevsky. Becky Jane Kramer, Magna Kumar. Courtney Nicole Coon. Keith Sigmund Coleman. Jonathan David Kirkendall. Carrie Ann Lane. Dawn 
Elaine Law, magna cum laude. Jill Nicole Law, magna cum laude. Justin Michael Lee, magna cum laude. Andrea Maria Lehman. Jamie Lee Little. Jillian Marie Lopicolo. Nicole Michael Lobecchia. Jennifer Lynn Lundberg. Benjamin Warren Lynchup. Gina Mary Marie Malpelli, cum laude. Monica Marie Matkovic, cum laude. Megan Kathleen McCoy. Denise Elaine Malott, summa cum laude. Gregory Barrett Meister. Christy Ann Miller, cum laude. Lindy Sue Miller, cum laude. Stuart Trent Miller. Stacy Nicole Motes, cum laude. Heather Dawn Motes, magna cum laude. Alicia Marie Mueller, magna cum laude. Julie Ann Knight. Jill Irene Knightford. Barbara Jean Newcomer, summa cum laude. Michael Lee Author. Angela Marie Panicella. Laura Ann Perez. Andrew Paul. Allison Evelyn Pagan. Christina Marie Piazza, cum laude. Amber Michelle Paisa. Nicole Avex Porter. Michael Edward Pratt. Sarah Ryan Quinter. Summa cum laude. Amanda Lee Redkay, cum laude. Jennifer Marie Reiner. Patty K. Reiner. Summa cum laude. Janice Marie Riggins. Kristen Marie Ritter, cum laude. Michelle Amber Rhoda. Kelly Catherine Roman. Sean Michael Rowe. Kelly Lynn Rock. Aaron Sanders, magna cum laude. Tanya Michelle Sainer, summa cum laude. Aaron Joseph Sharper. Mark Bradley Schultz. Jason Kenneth Schuler. Kelly Nicole Shank. Aaron Christopher Smith. Nicole Ann Smith. Jamie Leah Snyder, cum laude. Jessica Marie Spear. Aaron Marie Stansberry. Michael David Steffen. Dawn K. Strauss, cum laude. Casey Robert Stump. Rebecca Ann Swell, magna cum laude. Karen Teresa Tower. Emily Summer. Jennifer Lynn Toller. Christy Ann Utter. Stephanie Lynn Wall. Ryan Edward Walsh. Jamie Lee Walter, summa cum laude. Jennifer Washburn, cum laude. Michael Allen Watson. 
Jared Bradley Weber. Randall Renee Weifel, a Bachelor of Social Work and a Bachelor of Science. Alicia Marie Wyman, magna cum laude. Jennifer Lynn Wyman. Trisha Susan Whitmark. Karen Elaine Whitham cum laude. Chastity Ann Willie. Tammy J. Wilson. Erica Sean Wise, Magna Cum Laude. Sarah Cody Wright, Magna Cum Laude. Daniel Lee Yingling. Laura Elizabeth Yoder. Lizzie Lydia Yoder. Todd Michael Yon Cum Laude. Elise Nicole Ackerman. Stacy Lynn Adelsberger. Andreas Thomas Aguirre, cum laude. Amy Louise Ahrens. Richard Albertini. Corey Lee Alleman. Laura Ann Anderson, Christopher J. Arnold, Sabrina Pauline Asper, cum laude, Krista Maria Aron, Jessica Kane Baker, Joan Louise Barbara Giovanni. Heather Marie Barker. Chad Robert Berry, cum laude. Raymond Michael Basso. Victoria Mafalda Beard. Scott Forrest Bitcher. Rose Marie Bell. Elizabeth Claire Best. Ryan Eugene Betts. David Stephen Bickford, Magna Cum Laude. Joy Lynn Bingaman. Andrew Bernard Bitts, Summa Cum Laude. Sarah Kathleen Blair. Norman Matthew Flowers. Ryan Christopher Bond, Summa Cum Laude. Jamie Melissa Four. Yeah, Helena Marie Bonner. Yeah. Megan Elaine Boone. Jamie Lynn Boyer. Yeah. Mark 
Richard Boyer. Joshua D. Brady. Sam P. Bernese. Jamie Michelle Briggs, magna cum laude. Megan Brocious. Sarah Beth Broski. Nicola Tarita Brown. David Joseph Buckwalter. Jessica Lauren Bush. Courtney Ann Butler. Peggy Sue Callis, magna cum laude. Nathaniel Brennan Collier. Michael A. Covello. Corey Williams Campbell. Jacqueline Francis Kapinski. Patricia R. Carbone, cum laude. Keith Nicholas Carey. David Gray Carpenter. Magna Cum Laude. Molly Marie Kastner, Summa Cum Laude. James Anthony Cessary. Matthew Ryan Chambers. Kelly Marie Chernago. Jamia Yvonne Chin Garner. Amy Sue Chilco. <laughs> Melissa Lynn Clark. Sarah Beth Collins. Andrew R. Collins. Carolyn Ann Conley. Anna Louise Conway, cum laude. Jennifer Lynn Cook, cum laude. Shanna Elizabeth Cowan. Lindsay Marie Crovo. Andrew Fred Cooler, Brian Michael Davidson, Michelle Catherine DeFranco, Timothy Michael Deckman, Jennifer Lynn Dever, David William DeSecco, Bethany Karen Diefenderfer, Ty Quat Deese, Adam Butler DeGaudio. <laughs> Sheila Lee DeNazio. Timothy Michael DeLauro. Julie E. M. Doherty, magna cum laude. Benjamin Jared Drover. Arlo Anil Drusba. Elizabeth Ann Dramowski. Laura Elizabeth Eaton. Kate Marie Eggert. David Lee Eichelberger. Kimber Kimberly Lynn Eisenhower. Karen Sue Eichnayer. Rosa Eminato. Stephanie Lynn Engstrand. 
Courtney Beth Ernst, Mark Ashley Irwin, Mindy Danielle Fabrizio, Mary Alice Kathleen Fair, Justin James Finstermacher, Brianna Renee Finu, Tiffany M. Fisher, Thomas Daniel Ford, Christine Lynette Fraser, Ryan Scott Frumbau, Cum Laude, Robert James Gall, Magna Cum Laude, Allison Joan Gallagher, Kristen Ann Gallagher, Michael E. Garland Jr., Melissa Ann Damon, Summa Cum Laude, Nicholas Joseph Georgiantis, Eric Gerlich, Nina Lynn Ginsley, Justin Paul Gindelsberger, Christopher Allen Bryant, Nikki Allen Blunt, William R. Goldenbaum, Holly Lynn Gordon, Andrea Dogolovich, William B. Gregg, Heather J. Gregory, Ryan James Griffin Cum Laude, Jamie Lynn Gross, Jacqueline Patricia Ruler, Kelly Ann Gus, Sean Edward Hager, Charles Giff Hambrick Stowe, Jennifer Elizabeth Hamilton, Kelly Ann Hamlet, Michael William Hanawalk, Sina Kunale, Christina Jenny Hans, Dion Lamar Harrison, Ryan Michael Howe, Terrence Michael Hart, Ryan Sinclair Hartley, Douglas H. Hosenbein, Magna Cum Laude, Brian M. Owen, Cum Laude, Philip Allen Hayes, Nicole Ann Heiser, Sarah Marie Hinke, Sean Patrick Hennessy, Amanda Marie Henning, Amy Sue Hill, Summa Cum Laude, Heather June Hill, Rebecca Eileen Hilty, Cum Laude, Robert Lewis Hollister, Carolyn Ray Holsockel, Rachel Denise Paula, Summa Cum Laude, Brian Gregory Hoover, Melanie E. Post, Kirsten Elizabeth Houston, Charlie Wesley Powell, Sean Allen Huff, Randy K. Huffnagel, Magna Cum Laude, John P. Hughes, 
Zeb Robert Holt, Jennifer Melissa Hunt, Magna Cum Laude, Rachel Lena Hirsch, Cum Laude, Melissa Ann Iacono, Marsha Ray Jackson, Jessica Lynn Jingaleski, Cum Laude, Jamal O. Johnson, Rachel Ann Johnston, Devin Gerald Cater, Brian Robert Keller, Alisa Marie Kimmerer, Heather Lee Kennedy, Ryan Patrick Kennedy, Richard C. Kern Jr., Carl Kerr, Sean L. King, Andrew Derek Kling, Shannon Rose Klinger, Lori Louise Cockersberger, Peter Stephen Kova, Hillary Zara Korutz, Daniel Brent Click, Daniel Brent Creel, Cum Laude, Aaron Elizabeth Krug, Kelly Suzanne Crouch, Paul Cool Gavin, <laughs> Kelly Lynn Cole, <laughs> Rachel Esther Kurtz, <laughs> Matthew George Lackemeyer, <laughs> Elizabeth Ann Lacoe, <laughs> Nicole Marie LaGreca, who outed. William Allen Lane II, John Paul Lautenschlager, William Lee Leisure, Hannah Megan Lack, Casey William Winner, Summa Cum Laude. Kimberly A. Winner, David Arthur Lewis, Summa Cum Laude, Stephen Thomas Lazinski, Cum Laude, Bradley David Winner, Renee Nicole Lingenfelter, Tiffany Heather Link, Amy M. Lyle, Nancy Louise Lesh, Jamie Catherine Long, Joelle Renee Long, Megan Elizabeth Gallo Long, Magna Cum Laude. Jesse J. Lotney. Kelly Ann Lucas. Jason P. Lukic. Edward D. C. Lynch the Fourth. Kimber Kimberly York Lyons. Stephen Jack Madden, Julianne Makatara, Catherine M. Manello, Robert J. Marchetti, Donald Scott Morancic, Aaron Rennell Marshall, Summa Cum Laude, 
Kristen Ann Marshall. M. Catherine Marshall. Matthew Joseph Martin. Jessica Lee Martinez. Amy Eileen Maysmer. Sarah Ann Mayhew. Jarrett Angela Mozzarella. Summa Cum Laude. Colin Patrick McBride. Matt McBride. Brandon Michael McCausland, Magna Cum Laude. Gary Scott McCallacher. Aaron Elizabeth McLeat. Shanna Louise McClintock. Shelly Jean McElwee. <laughs> Kathleen McLaughlin. Stuart Desmond McLean. Brett Elias Anthony Neal. Jerusha Elizabeth Mendez. <laughs> Mark Christopher Mincer. Thomas E. Mertz Jr. Rosemary Eleanor Middlecamp. Rachel Elizabeth Middlesworth. Matthew Ryan Miller, Magna Cum Laude. Wayne Lee Miller III. Allison Susan Miner. Nikki Lee Minich. Joshua W. Mitchell. Dana Marie Monlish, Cum Laude. Sarah Susan Moore. Patricia Marie Moser. Jennifer Sue Mauer. Matthew Charles Moyer. James Andrew Muir. Megan Christine Murphy. Magna Tunade. Cherie Marie Musgrave. Sean Lynn Myers. Beth Colleen Nagel. Andrea New. Adam C. Newcomer. Lucia D. Wynn, Magna Cum Laude. Richard F. Norris. Jennifer Marie O'Neill, Cum Laude. Andrea Jan Osasek. Don G. Ott. Melissa Florence Palermo. Robert Terry Holland. Robert Fletcher Park. Joseph M. Pike. Rebecca Lynn Perry. Thomas James Petrel Jr. Magna Cum Laude. Michael Robert Peters. Justin Lancer Pink. Jeanette Ellis Pazinski. Joseph Victor Pinkerton. Adam Joseph Powell. Matthew David Powell. Timothy Robert Powell. Marie Elise Powell. 
Charles William Prenderville. Peter Benjamin Price. Tammy LaDawn Princeton, magna cum laude. <coughs> Gregory Michael Puckett. Sarah Ann Persley. Mandy Lee Foote. Deidre Nancy Sher Pye. Carolyn M. Rockow. Sophia Enid Ramos. Tony Leslie Reaver. Aaron Michael Reed. Heather Marie Reed. Robert George Reed III. Mark Robert Riedenbach. Eric Justin Riesinger. And Elizabeth Richards. Karen M. Richardson Griffin. Alicia Doreen Roberts. William Waller Grow. Ian Rosario. John Paul Ross. Sarah Elizabeth Ruane. Leonard Michael Sabatino. Rhonda Lee Salehead. Thomas G. Santana Jr. Matthew Sean Santos. Thomas Andrew Sasson. Christy Sue Shale. Donna Marie Chitro. Nathan Fletcher Shell. Andrea J. Snyder. Ruth Lee Schulter. Aaron Kelly Swagger. Melvin Lamont Scott. Christopher George Septus. Lisa Marie Sennett. Michael T. Schaefer. Ray Daniel Schaefer. Heather Marie Shearer. Milton Tara. Jerome. Melanie Carol Sheriff. Marjorie K. Schiff. W. Randall Schiff. Colleen Ann Chauvin. Randy Lee Showall. Nathaniel Moore Sims. Andrew Myers Simple. Joshua Michael Sisko. Edward Lee Smith, the second. Holly Hosford Smith, summa cum laude. James Stephen Smith. Joanna Jill Smith, magna cum laude. Kelly Aaron Smith. Sally Ann Smith. Sean Craig Smith, cum laude. Wayne Scott Smith, Jr. Thomas Eugene Snyder. Justin Wade Solenberger. Samuel John Spencer. Tiffany Renee Starr. Jason Bradley Staves. Jessica L. Staver. James William Staver. Jason William Stiegelman. John P. Steiner, Gregory Sean Stockton, Trevor Pryor Stoudemire, Dinah Faye Strickhausen, Laurie Ann Strickler, summa cum laude, receiving Bachelor of Arts and Bachelor of Science, Nancy Jean Struber, Jana Lynn Swartz, Joseph John Sweeney. Kevin Maurice Sweeper. Stephanie Elaine Swisher. Christy Jacqueline Swartz. Ilana Rachel Tabak, cum laude. 
Jeffrey Matthew Tackett. Jill Kathleen Tallarico, Tim Laude. Anir Titi, Suma Tim Laude. Curtis Michael Titter. Brooke Richard Tolbert. Kristen Marie Townsend. Damian Turner. Brian Michael Uptegrove. Jason N. Benudes. Courtney Allison Backer. Jennifer Joe Vendee. Deidre Denise Spencer. Melissa Marie Pizza. Christy Lynn Von Blow. Jamie P. Wall. Mark Thomas Walter. Andrea K. Raylan. William Jason Webb. Allison J. Weiner. Jeffrey L. Weinhold. Ann Elise Wendell. Laura Elizabeth West. Russell William Werner, cum laude. Barbara Grace Wheeler, magna cum laude. Robert E. White. Beth Lynn Winkler. Amy Christine Wolf. Kevin Ryan Woods. Neil Ralph Robleski, Jr. Julian L. Wyman. R. Y. Jerome. Diane Lynn Yeager, from Lyon. Bridget Ann Zeller. Thomas E. Zimmerman. Gregory Allen Zirkel, Magna Cum Laude. Stephen Anthony Ziza, Jr. Joseph Adam Zapanik, Jr. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the singing of the national anthem and then the benediction by Father Young. of good times and difficulties together, and full of hope and concern for the days ahead, let us ask God's blessing on these our graduates. O oh God, you led your servant Abraham from his home and guarded him throughout his journey to unknown lands. Guide these graduates through the pilgrimage of life. Be a refuge for them on their journey. Shade in the heat, shelter in the storm, rest in weariness, 
protector in trouble, and strength in danger. For all our days together, we give you thanks. Even though we may be far apart in the future, bind us together in the spirit of your love, now and forever. Amen. Ladies and gentlemen and graduates, we've stretched the weather, I think, as far as we can this afternoon. Congratulations to all of our new graduates. The university is proud of you. This concludes the ceremony. Please remain seated until the reception will conclude. Thank you.